Hello, I'm Kathy Barnes with Academic Technology, and welcome to Creating Portfolios in Blackboard. After logging into Blackboard, select the arrow to the right of your name. This will open the Global Navigation drop-down window. To minimize the top section, click Courses. Click Tools. Select Portfolios from the drop-down menu. From the My Portfolios page, you can create and view your portfolios. My Artifacts is where you collect digital files to use in your portfolios. Shared with me displays other portfolios shared with you. Click My Artifacts to add photos, graphics, videos, sounds, or documents. Click Add Personal Artifact. Enter the artifact title in the title text box. Scroll down. Enter the desired description in the description text box and scroll down. Enter the content of the artifact in the content text box and scroll down. Select Browse My Computer or Browse My Content Collection, My Files, depending on where the desired file is located. Select the checkbox to the left of the desired file and scroll down. Click Submit from the bottom right. The link title will display in the text box. Click Submit. Select Add from Course to add artifacts from a course. This will allow access to the artifacts after you no longer have access to the course. Select the radio button to the left of the desired course. Click the checkbox for the desired file within the course and scroll down. To click Submit. To create a new portfolio, click My Portfolios. Select Create Portfolio. Input the desired title in the text box. Input the description in its text box if needed and scroll down. To share a portfolio, make sure the available checkbox is selected. The Comments Are Private checkbox allows a viewer to comment. The viewer will not be able to see others' comments. Select Submit from the bottom right. The pop-up window offers the option to take the tour of portfolios. We'll continue by selecting No Thanks, I'll Explore on my own. Select Click Here to add a header to your portfolio. Enter the header in the text box provided and select Save from the right. Click Section 1 to input the appropriate text in the text box provided and select Add Artifact. From Add Artifacts to Portfolio page, select the desired file and click Submit from the bottom right. Select any desired text options from the Content Editor, including font, size, and alignment. After entering the appropriate text, click Save from the right. The header, artifact title link, and description will display. To add another artifact, click the plus icon below. Input the artifact title and click Add Artifact. Select the desired artifact. Note this is an assignment artifact. Click Submit. Since it is an assignment artifact, you are given options to include description, name, feedback, grade, and submission information. After selecting the checkboxes of the content you wish to include, click the Close button. Input the appropriate text and options from the Content Editor and click Save. Select Click Here to add a footer to your portfolio. Enter the footer text. and click Save from the bottom right. To change the order of the items, click and drag the artifact to the desired position. To add a page, select the plus icon above Page 1 in the left menu. Enter the page title if desired. Reposition the page to its new location. Delete the page if needed by clicking the trash can to the right of the item. A pop-up window will ask, are you sure you want to delete page, page 2? Click OK. From the upper right corner, click Settings to open the Portfolio Settings. You can edit the title, 
description, or availability from this page. Click Cancel to continue. Select Preview and Customize. Select the desired layout from the Layout drop-down menu. Select the desired color and background design from the color drop-down menu. When you have found the color and background design you like, click Save from the top right. Click Close to return to the Portfolio Editing page. Select Done Editing to return to the list of your portfolios. Click More from the options under the portfolio. The drop-down menu allows you to access Settings, Share, View Comments, Download Your Portfolio to Keep, or Delete. Click the X in the upper right corner to close the drop-down window. Thank you. This tutorial was developed by Western Kentucky University, Information Technology Division. If you have questions or need further assistance, please contact the IT Help Desk at 270 745-7000.